In this video, I'll show you how to easily create a kitchen in Blender using Archipack Pro and how to make a basic render using a free add-on. First, delete everything. Go to the Create section, select Kitchen and add a floor cabinet. Then, go to the Archipack section and select Edit Parameters. We want a basic look without handles or any additional details. Once you're satisfied with your design, go to the Cabinet section, change the type to Full and come back to the main section to increase the height to 20. Then expand the first cabinet section and add a left baseboard and a left sideboard because it is the first cabinet on the left side. Increase the number of doors to 2 and adjust each one accordingly. You can modify the door type and the height. Duplicate the first cabinet and remove the sideboard. Duplicate the second cabinet, change the type to floor, decrease the door number to 1 and add an oven. Duplicate and adjust the next cabinets in the same way and then add a cooktop and a sink. Next, we'll add some wall cabinets. Duplicate the last cabinet, change the type to wall and click reset to align it with the first cabinet. Move it next to the second cabinet then duplicate and customize the cabinets as we did previously. To add a second row of wall cabinets, duplicate the last one, click Reset and adjust position, height and width, and then duplicate it to complete the kitchen. Now let's create the room. Click Shift A to add a plane and make it 30 cm larger than the kitchen. Then right click and select Convert to Curve. Go to Create, Walk from Curve and choose Generic 30 by 300. With the wall selected, go to Archipack Click the key icon and add floor, floor moldings and ceiling slab. Next, add a camera, center the view and press Ctrl Alt Numpad 0 to move the camera to your view. Then go to view and enable camera to view to adjust the view as you prefer. You can also enable some composition guides in camera properties. When you're happy with the result, remember to disable the camera to view option. You can change the floor tiles dimension in the Archipack properties. In this case, they are 1 meter by 1 meter. Add a rail window, then cut the floor molding pressing S and delete the section. To add objects, materials and HDRIs, you can use the free version of Blender Kit. Go to Render Preview, Enable Cycles and add an HDRI. In Shading Mode, you can adjust the power and position of the HDRI. To do it, change Z rotation and strength. I decided to modify the window and then I had to adjust the floor molding, dragging the right vertex along the Y axis. I find it useful to use a basic cube to download the materials from Blender Kit. Then select the kitchen, add them to the material properties of Blender and assign them in the material section of Archipack. You can always modify the materials in the shading section. In this case, I added a node to make the marble lighter and decrease the saturation.
Then add a cube, modify it in this way to create some finishing and assign it a black material. Now let's add some assets from Blender Kit. Choose the ones you like, drag them into the scene and edit them. Next, add two rectangular lights to improve the overall lighting of the scene and make the final adjustments. Check the video description for links to other kitchen tutorials. Please let me know in the comments if you have any questions. Thanks for watching and see you next time!